Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid all fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Do you have any recommendations about what to do on Nos Astra? Our trading center is directly ahead. You'll find restaurants and shops nearby as well. I suggest you browse our shopping kiosks. You can find things on Nos Astra that you can't find anywhere else in the galaxy. What can you tell me about Nos Astra? It's an exciting city. We see a lot of new cultures and goods because of our proximity to the Terminus systems. At the same time, Ilium is still in a sorry world. You should be as safe here as you would be on the Citadel. For your own safety, however, I recommend against signing anything. What's so dangerous about signing something? Ilium is a free trade world commander. Contract term requirements are more relaxed here than on other planets. It's a small price to pay for keeping our competitive edge in goods from the Terminus systems. You mentioned trading. What gets traded on Ilium? Anything you can imagine, Commander. Ilium is a wonderful world for those who can afford it. In order to remain competitive as a Terminus Systems port, we've relaxed many of the standards you'd find on other Asari worlds. Most drugs are legal, provided they are labeled properly. You can buy almost any weapon or technology. You can even buy indentured servants. I can't believe an Asari world would allow slavery. We try to avoid calling it slavery. All indentured servants on Ilium have voluntarily agreed to a term of service. Most choose indentured service as a means to pay off debt or avoid imprisonment. A contract holder is responsible for the well-being of her servants, and a servant's duties are agreed upon before the contract is signed. You said Liara was here? What's she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. I'm on a mission. Can you help me find someone? I can help you find major entertainment centers or stores, but I'm afraid I can't point you to individual people. Liara is excellent at that type of work, however. I imagine she can help you. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier, as well. And that by limiting the slave trade, the Council is violating their cultural rights. The indentured servitude market closed... Hello, Commander Shepard. Liara will be pleased to see you. You're Liara's assistant? Yes. Liara relies upon me to acquire useful intelligence. I don't have her network of contacts, but I supply her with supplemental data. It's really an honor to work with her. What's Liara's reputation here on Ilium? She is greatly respected. In a few short years, she's amassed a sizable network of connections. She could have even more political power than she already wields if she weren't so focused on her personal goals. But I believe she should tell you about that, not me. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. Have you faced an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. I'll make it simple. Either you pay me, or I flay you alive. With my mind. Shepard! Nixeris, hold my calls. My sources said you were alive, but I never believed. It's very good to see you. You have sources now? A few. Sources, contacts, even a little hired muscle. I've been working as an information broker. It's paid the bills since you... well, for the past two years. And now you're back, gunning for the Collectors with Cerberus. That's not exactly public knowledge. Neither is you being alive, Shepard. Information is my business now. And if you need information on finding people, I'm happy to help. There's an Asari named Samara here on Ilium. Do you know where I could find her? Samara? Yes. She arrived recently and registered with tracking officer Dara. 
You can find Dara at the transportation hub. I'm looking for Thane Krios. He's supposed to be here on Ilium. The assassin? Yes. He arrived here a few days ago. My sources tell me he may be targeting a corporate executive, Nasana Dantius. He contacted a woman named Serena. Serena has an office in the cargo transfer levels. Perhaps she can tell you where Krios is. That was all just off the top of your head? I'm a very good information broker, Shepard. The world of intrigue isn't that different from a dig site. Except that the dead bodies still smell. Thanks for the help. That's all I needed to know. Of course. If there's anything else I can help you with, let me know. What about you, Liara? I could use your help on this mission. I can't, Shepard. I'm sorry. I have commitments here. Things I need to take care of. What kind of things do you need to take care of? Are you in trouble? No, no trouble. But it's been a long two years. I had things to do while you were gone. I have debts to repay. Listen, if you want to help, I need someone with hacking expertise. Someone I can trust. If you could disable security at key points around Ilium, you could get me information I need. That would help me a great deal. What's this all about, Liara? Can't you just talk to me? Don't you think I want to, Shepard? This isn't because I don't trust you. This is Ilium. Anything I say is probably being recorded. If it'll help you, I'll take care of it. When you hack one, a server will open somewhere nearby for a short time. You can download data from there, if you hurry. Thank you, Shepard. This may help me pay a great debt. I'll talk to you later, Liara. Serena? Who wants to know? Name Shepard. Liara Tassoni said you might have information on Thane Krios. Tana, cover for me. Over here. Yeah, I know who Thane Krios is. I might have passed him some information, but I didn't hire him. What do you want to know? Just tell me what you know about him. I ran security for Nasana Dantius. Then I found out she was having people killed to cover up her dirty secrets. She fired me when I confronted her. Her loss. I might have been good enough to stop Thane from taking her down. Just tell me where I can find Thane. The Dantius Towers. Penthouse level of Tower 1. There's a second tower, still under construction. If Thane is smart, he'll go in from there. It doesn't sound like Nasana's just gonna let me in. She's as smart as she is paranoid. No one's getting in or out of there without a fight. I can get you in, but you'll only get one shot. You'd better be ready. Do you know anything else about Thane? Not much. He did say that he's not doing the hit for money. Nobody hired him. I wanted to know who I was helping, and he said he's doing this job on his own. That he had to restore the balance of his life. I don't know. Maybe he's crazy. If he takes down Nasana, I don't care why he does it. You're just offering your help? No strings attached? You're going to look for Thane. Nasana's mercenaries will try to stop you. At the least, you'll distract her guards. Take a little fire, give Thane a clear shot. I didn't hire him to kill Nasana, but I won't shed any tears when she gets what's coming to her. Let's go, then. Good. I'm tired of this crap. We'll go tonight, as soon as the shift workers clear out of Tower 2. The towers are heavily guarded, and you'll find more resistance closer to the penthouse. So, this assassin. You planning to stop him? I'm just here to make sure he survives. Hmm. Towers. You'll have to get up to the second tower and cross the bridge to the penthouse. Her mercs will fight you every step, but it's your best chance. Why don't we just save time and take the shuttle up? She's got mercs with rockets just waiting for you to try. You get maybe halfway up before they shot you down. Besides, your assassin won't go in that way. Best to go in low. 
All right. Let's do this. Hold on. too long. They'll be here to greet you soon enough. Good luck, Shepard. He's still alive. I can't feel my legs. My chest is killing me. Who did this to you? And why? We're just night workers. Nasana sent them after us. She sent the mechs to round us up, but we didn't hear. They just started shooting. They just attacked you? Yes. They were too slow. It was horrible. Everyone screaming. The mechs said there was no time. Nasana wanted us out of the way. Immediately. Then... <coughs> the dogs... <coughs> He's not going to make it if we don't help him. Here. That should ease the pain and keep you alive until help arrives. Really? This guy? Why? Take your time. I think I'm better. Find the other workers. Help them. I need to get up to the penthouse. Any suggestions? Take the service elevator to the upper floors. The bridge between the towers isn't finished, but if you're careful, watch out for the mercs. They're everywhere. Any idea how many mercs Nassan has got? A lot. Dozens of them are wandering around here all day. You'll find more the further up you go. Why would Nasana kill her own workers? To her, we're expendable. But I didn't realize she was that ruthless. My friends, co-workers, slaughtered. They were jumping off ledges to escape the dogs. I'll do what I can. Thank you. Let's get moving.
Please, don't kill us. We'll go, we'll go. Hey, look, they're not Eclipse. You're here to help us, right? It's one reason I'm here. Come on out. It's safe enough. Thank you. We are in your debt. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for someone, not a merc. He's on his own. Well, whoever sealed us in here... When he found us, I thought we were dead. But he just closed the door and locked us in. Locked you in? Sounds like our assassin was trying to keep them safe. Assassin? Here for Nasana, I bet. She's got it coming. You treat people like this, it always comes back to bite you in the ass. I need to get to Nasana's penthouse. What's the quickest way? Cargo elevator is the only way up right now. They're still working up top. Watch your step. Some of the walls aren't in, and it's a long way down. Cold, too. I hate working up there. Nasana's not exactly your favorite person? She's a hard woman to work for. That's an understatement. She works as long hours, no overtime, and this is what you get in payment. She's unpleasant, to say the least. Why not just quit? We would if we could. What's stopping you? Our contract. We're stuck until the job's done. Quitting for any reason can be hazardous to your health. We hear that anyone who leaves early tends to disappear. Probably just a rumor. But who wants to find out for sure? Did you see the one who locked you in? Do you know where he might have gone? He's no Solarian, I can tell you that. But I've no idea where he went. Sorry. If he's after Nasana, he'll be heading to the upper levels. How many workers were in the tower? Are there many more of you? Not alive. We were lucky. Well, some got out before the dogs were sent in. Maybe a few are hiding somewhere. I wouldn't stay here too long. It should be safe down on the lower floors. I was just thinking the same thing. Let's go, everybody! Thank you. And tell your assassin to aim for her head. Because she doesn't have a heart. Get moving! We're a little exposed out here, especially if anyone's in that elevator. We should get behind... stuff. Enemies, have a pleasant day. Grabbing cover! Right, they've Watch seen it. for the drone! <laughs> Seen the assassin? Why are you looking for him? You're not one of Nasana's mercs. Who are you? Answer my questions and I'll let you go. Look, pal. Even if I knew where he was, I wouldn't tell you. Not the answer I was looking for. I've got nothing more to say to you. If you shoot me, my team's right through there. They'll be all over you. Is a little information really worth dying over? Is Nasana? No. I suppose not. Okay, look. Last I heard, the assassin was down on the mezzanine. But the teams on the bridge think they might have spotted him. Nobody knows for sure. Get out of here. I'm going. The ocean one. Anybody else would have killed him.
go! On the ground, now! Deploying war field! You guys all right in here? Get back! Get back! I'll shoot! Relax. Don't do anything you'll regret. I don't want to hurt you, but I will. I said get back! I'll do it! Please, don't make me do it. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. What's your name? I... I'm Talon. Don't... Don't come any closer. Talon, I'm Commander Shepard. I don't work with the Mercs, and I don't want to hurt you. I'm here to help. I... All right. Here. I, uh, don't feel so... Tell him! He's my brother. I just want to see if he's all right. Are you the ones who shot the Merc? It wasn't me. Your brother didn't do it? No. Tell him was standing here with me. What happened exactly? The Merc found us and shouted at us to move. We, we panicked, and he shouted more. I thought he was going to kill us, then his head just exploded. Tell him, picked up the Merc's gun, but we were too afraid to leave. Then you showed up. A perfect headshot, but no collateral damage. Very impressive. How safe is that bridge out there? The bridge is stable, but the wind's your real problem. If it doesn't throw you off, the Mercs will definitely try. There's a lot of them out there. I'm looking for someone. Probably the guy who killed this Merc. Talon thought he saw someone following us, but he's been a bit... on edge. I haven't seen anyone but the Mercs. Is the bridge the only way to the penthouse and the other tower? From here, yeah. It won't be easy. Mercs are patrolling the other side. Whatever Nasana's hiding from must be pretty scary. There are still Mercs up here. You should get to the lower levels. No need to convince me. Talon, come on, get up. Can we go home now? Yeah, we're getting out of here. Thank you. I'm afraid your men aren't able to respond, so.
missiles! Forget the explosives! He's already past us! This should come in handy. We've been spotted. I don't care what you do. No one gets across that bridge. Wait. Before you kill me, just tell me who hired you.
Who do you think it was? Screw you. Charming. Kill me then. I'm not playing your stupid games. Well, you made it this far. Now what? You really think I'm here to kill you? Do you have another reason for destroying my tower? Decimating my security? I'm just looking for someone. You expect me to believe that? Is it credits? Is that what you want? Just tell me your price. We can make this problem go away. Make me an offer. Double whatever you're getting. And I'll pay double again if you tell me who hired you. What? I heard something. Damn it. Check the other entrances. You stay put. When I'm finished dealing with this nuisance, you and I are going to... <laughs> certainly know how to make an entrance. I was hoping to talk to you. I apologize, but prayers for the wicked must not be forsaken. Do you really think she deserves it? Not for her. For me. The measure of an individual can be difficult to discern by actions alone. Take you, for instance. All this destruction, chaos. I was curious to see how far you'd go to find me. Well, here I am. How did you know I was coming at all? I didn't. Not until you marched in the front door and started shooting. Nasana had become paranoid. You saw the strength of her guard force. She believed one of her sisters would kill her. You were a valuable distraction. Let's cut to the chase. I need you for a mission. Indeed. You're familiar with the Collectors? By reputation. They're abducting entire human colonies. Freedom's Progress was their handiwork. I see. We're going after them. Attacking the Collectors would require passing through the Omega-4 Relay. No ship has ever returned from doing so. They told me it was impossible to get to Ilos, too. A fair point. You've built a career on performing the impossible. This was to be my last job. I'm dying. Low survival odds don't concern me. The abduction of your colonists does. You're dying. Are you contagious? How long do you have? If you're interested, we can discuss it on your ship. The problem isn't contagious, and it won't affect my work. I hadn't heard that. Is there anything I can do? Giving me this opportunity is enough. The universe is a dark place. I'm trying to make it brighter before I die. Many innocents died today. I wasn't fast enough and they suffered. I must atone for that. I will work for you, Shepard. No charge. Impressive stories, Krios. Sounds like you'll be an asset to the team. That is, if you're comfortable having an assassin watch your back. I've accepted a contract. My arm is Shepard's. Uh-huh. Don't know about you, but I'm loyal to more than my next paycheck. Obviously he is, too. He's doing this mission gratis. What's your concern? I don't like mercenaries. An assassin is just a precise mercenary. An assassin is a weapon. A weapon doesn't choose to kill. The one who wields it does. Where shall I put my things? I'd prefer someplace dry if anything is available. The area near the life support plant on the crew deck tends to be slightly more arid than the rest of the ship. Ah, an AI. 
My thanks. He seems quite civil. We need all the help we can get. He's not what I expected in an assassin. He may surprise you. Yeah. And he may not. <laughs>